So this environment um, for a lot of practitioners who are not comfortable with being in, in this kind of open environment is very challenging and I think not having a boundary, not having um, a, a physical limitation of where children can go is, is quite challenging for a lot of staff members. So we've just over the years have kind of been developing how we work with the staff as well so they get an understanding because the, the children get so many benefits from the risky atmosphere that's here and it's risky in the terms of challenging. Um, it supports them to make their own decisions and to make their own choices. My role really is just coming out and joining, joining the kids on site and um, yeah helping to shed a bit of light on um, aspects of the woodland, um, certain animals, plants, trees, all the characters that live here. In terms of my background in ecology and, and woodland management, it's really nice to be able to use some of that knowledge and that familiarity that I have and have built up over the years and share that with people who have the desire to connect and the willingness to, to engage and, and get to know the woodland. We have been coming up to the woods uh, two days a week for as long as I've been working here and um, each time we come up here I get hands-on support from my manager Jane and we get practical experience about how to support the children in the woods and we learn how to build rope swings, guddle in streams and support the children to have the best fun they can and I get the excellent support from all my colleagues who help me when I don't know what to do. Our, our staff are all obviously trained practitioners and um, so I've got um, trained um, early childhood educators and a support worker um, but on top of that we've also gone through forest leader training so I've done the forest leader level 8 um, training and then I've got two members of staff who've gone through forest leader level 6 and that's really important to us it's not necessary to be to be working outdoors to have that qualification but because of the way we work and where we are for me that's really important that my staff have an understanding and a passion uh, and enthusiasm for the outdoors and for nature